going back to replay. Thundercats! Ho! Oh! <laughs> this is pranks against the door. Wait, if I already... I just son of a bitch, I just had to push it. <laughs> See, it went away. <laughs> Damn it. Did I, like, accidentally do that when I put the controller down to go pee? No, it was, that was just part of the cutscene. Huh. Oh. I wasn't paying attention. Okay, so beam of light. Time to walk into the god beam. <laughs> this is the sealed temple. <gasps> nope, pots. Shit. There's an old woman here. That's a hell of a hat lady. Yeah. She's got this cool, like... Oh my gosh, she's... Not a care braid. Literally, um... Fuck, what's her name from, uh... From Jack and Daxter. Or Jack 2. Oh, yeah. The, well, yeah. I recently bought all the Jack and Daxter games. H have you played them all? Yes. Oh, at yeah. least once. Um, I don't remember them as well. They're so well, mm -hmm. But... They're yeah, so hard. Well, like, I went... So Vintage Stock had a Memorial Weekend sale. Uh-huh. And I went there and... <laughs> I, I like the... Twad? Uh, twad. The, the, the ellipsis is just kind of like... Quad. That's that's what it was. <laughs> that's what your I fucking heard. name. So yeah, they had a memorial weekend sale. Buy two get one free, and it's not like the that's not like the greatest deal ever. But I bought the entire Jack and Daxter and all of the Ratchet and Clanks uh -huh. for and Assassin's Creed Black Flag for sixty bucks. Shit. So I felt pretty good about that's, that deal. That's quite a few. Yeah. I already had. Um, I guess the only game I didn't buy. So I have. All, I also have Jack and Daxter. Or, uh, what is it called? Jack X Combat Racing. I've never is, played that. It's such a good game. It's so much fun. It's it's not a Jack and Daxter game at all. It's just a racing game. Yeah. But it's a lot of fun. Um, it's basically like hardcore Mario Kart. Mm -hmm. You get rockets and stuff and you shoot people down. And there's like, whenever you die, there's like a cool explosion scene. That it's sounds fun. awesome. It's a lot of fun. I used to play online back when PS2 online was free. I'm really looking forward to the... Uh... The Last of Us racing game. That will be the Last of Us racing game. Well, it's just, just been the run pattern. Zombies over. Like Naughty Dog did Crash and, or yeah, Crash Bandicoot, and then that became a racing game. Didn't Naughty Dog did Jack also? And Dexter. Naughty Dog did Jack and Dexter, didn't they? Yeah. Okay. And then that got a racing game, so I'm just assuming. <laughs> You're just <laughs> it, logic dictates. Yeah, it's gonna be the next one they do. Um, well, they, they've got to get three have games you first. Crash and Clank. No. You've never played Ratchet no, and Clank? No, I haven't. And Ratchet I... and Clank is awesome. Uh, that's one of those games that I plan on... Oh, shit. I've that? just been ignoring this. Oh, just... <laughs> Don't worry about it. Sorry, viewers. You can put beacons down, and it'll uh -huh. let you, like, see where they are. Yeah, and she's insisting that I do this, so... Uh... Yeah, so put it on the X. Oh, you just put it down over there. You have to uh... move... Yeah, it's the C button. Yeah. Oh, I see. Oh! Oh, this is gonna make what me barf. What did you barf. do? I don't know. All right, now you All go. Right, we're good. Yeah, see so it. you'll literally see a blue light when you get to it. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah. It's kind of useful. Never fear getting lost. Go now. The it's... one you call Zelda. Take the treasure chest. Mm -hmm. Uh, Ding. the one you're summoning with your hair clock metronome thing. Clefairy. Clefairy. <laughs> Boom! Yeah, things explode. She's a cool character. You'll learn more about her later. For now, it's Wad. Go briefly. But yeah, we should play the first Ratchet and Clank on your channel. Yeah. That's a great game. Oh, God. Bright light. Why did I do this? <laughs> oh, I should have worn an eye patch. Oh, God. Actually, that wouldn't have helped at all. No, but, no. no. It would just the make other one way I take all the light. Yeah. See, there's your, there's your beacon that you set. Sweet. That's a laser beam going to kill the moon. <laughs> Which, no, it's like a... That's like how an, it ties It's an airstrike. That's how it ties into Majora's <laughs> Mask, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's how we kill the moon. There's an attack, and um, if you power... So you get the hookshot in Hyrule Warriors, uh -huh. and if you power it up with a... You get, like, hookshot power-ups, you what can... is Hyrule Warriors, exactly? It's Dynasty Warriors with Zelda. It's literally that. Huh. Like, it's not much different from a normal Hy uh, Dynasty Warriors game, but I like it a lot. You can, is this seriously how he... Oh, I yeah, thought he was just, like, it holding it directly. Hold, hold it down. You can roll it. Huh. You bowling. This is, what, this is what Aaron was talking about. This is Bomb gimmicky bowling. as fuck as yeah. shit. Like... Uh, yeah, roll it into him. What? Didn't go to him. Just go kill them all. Shit, man. <laughs> I'm coming at you. Oh, <laughs> 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 waggle, waggle, they're, waggle. Yeah, they're blocking you. <laughs> just gonna... 
Seriously? Oh, so this is... It's literally Wii Swordplay. Like, the yeah. Wii, Wii Sports Resort. It kind of, like yeah. you just It pretty much is. <laughs> oh, you're a good guy? You're kind of weird <laughs> just, looking. Ah, ah, he doesn't, he'd never seen a Goron before, so he's just like, ah, <laughs> just can slash. Slice. He's like, I was your friend. Fuck, I did that in Bloodborne. <laughs> you killed the, the guy? Yeah, I... Because you can kill pretty much anything. You can kill everything you come across in that game. Uh, okay, actually, what's this guy telling me? Uh, I think you can activate. Ooh, excuse me. You can oh. activate the goddess statue. Oh, uh, ancient history. I don't care about history. You can use the goddess statues to go back up into the sky, basically. Okay, cool. what he's cool. telling you. Okay, cool. Stop telling me this. Yeah, it does sound crazy. You sound crazy. Why are you still talking to me? Real head scratcher, bud. Hey, we're not friends. Not we just really. met. <laughs> does not make me want to know more. Anyway, so yeah, you get to this guy who's like in a chapel and he's like, uh, if you find any people, like normal people out there, let them know and like, I'll, I'll, like, I'll help them. And he does this like weird kind of creepy laugh. So I was like, I don't trust you. So naturally I stabbed him in the face. <laughs> and, uh, as he was dying, he was just like, I just wanted to help people. And I'm like, fuck, I made a big mistake. Clearly you were an alright dude. Oh yeah, you gotta push the log. That's what I do. That's... You push push logs? That, that, yeah. It's just your log pusher. Uh, I'm just, uh... <laughs> pushing it over. Oh god. Uh, get up there, Link. It's really impressive that he grabs on with one hand. His buff. parkour is pretty impressive. Yeah. It makes it better than, like, walking up to a wall and then... Look. Yeah. <laughs> Pulling yourself up. Oh my god, Shut Please, up. stop talking to me forever. I hate you. I really don't like this lady. Real big tree. Far now I see why everyone hated her. Yeah, she's pretty she, terrible. Shut up. At least she doesn't go, hey, listen, every single fucking time. Yeah, but then she goes, master, I have information. And then she does this thing where she'll be like, if there's like an event, she's like, there's like an 87% chance that this will happen if you do this. And it's basically saying, hey, push this button. <laughs> it's so dumb. Can you please just like be straightforward with me? Mrs. Exposition. So now you've got the... Okay, cool. It's like zoom in, zoom in, zoom in, zoom in. Enhance. Uh, 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 zoom. Uh, uh. Enhance. And then it orients to which way you're facing. Lovely. It's extremely likely that Zelda's here. Okay. Maybe you should use your dousing ability. Just fucking t point your dick. Uh, yeah. Where is she? Yeah. See, Can I, like, go. run while I'm doing this? No. She's... But it shows you where she is. Okay, so it starts like... Vi oh, okay, I see that. It's like, you see the arrow? She's that way. The dick always knows where his lady is. Or something like that. Ha! <laughs> ha! <laughs> yeah. Those uh, trees looked a little, uh... Looked a little, like... Yeah, they don't have a whole lot going on, dude. What is that? There's no point to lock on here. Almost. Or like, not yeah. yet. Not yet, no. It actually makes it harder. Yeah. I do like how when you chop trees... You can keep chopping like oh that. Oh my god, why am I yawning so much? Long trying, day. You'll get it. Not even. Oh, I did it. I went to work for a while, but it wasn't that much work. It was I did get to drive a golf cart me. today. That was fun. Ooh, golf carts are the best. Yeah, on campus. It's always fun. Because you're just like, people, get out of the way. He's adorable! He's like a penguin. It's so weird. They're called the... Oh, he sounds adorable! Okay, I don't like the plant tumor thing, though. Kweeku! Now there's a green one. I didn't even know they came in green. Oh, so are the other knights bad guys now? No, it, uh, it's... I think it's talking about humans. Like, assume... I'm assuming that, like, some other humans came through here and, like, did some uh, shit. Zelda. Yeah, so, like, if she's saying that, like, like, she could read Zelda on that life form. She is absolutely some, like, alien. It's magic. 
Yeah, but she's calculating probabilities and stuff. Like it's yeah. this the sort of like Thor thing. Yeah, the characters in this game seem pretty pretty alien. Okay. Um, it's weird. Oh. So they're called, the, they're called <laughs> Kikwis. Uh-huh. It's definitely one of those situations where it's like magic and science seem the same because you don't understand. Yeah. Uh-huh. I believe I looked it up the other day on um, TV Tropes. Magic by any other name. Yeah. I, I really like that. I actually had a theory that I came up yesterday. Because um, I'm of the opinion that it's totally okay. Like, Ultron was right, in a way. Like, humans need to evolve by, like, replacing ourselves with robots. But, like, there's no real need for violence, you know? We can just kind of make AI. Do I have to, like, activate this for it to... No, you can just... Okay. They're just... Uh, activated. So once we make AI, like, we can just kind of start, like, adopting them instead of, like, having more babies. Oh, God. It These would, things are it, hard. Yeah. Uh, so then just, like, slowly over time, like, humans just kind of, like, let themselves die out, and then... Oh, fucking hell. Well, I mean, like... I don't know. I bet... I bet we could, like, keep... If we could figure out how to get people's minds into robots... Oh, that would be ideal, but that's probably harder. And probably. And to about the same effect, you know? But, like, wouldn't you think that, like, if we start replacing ourselves with AI, it would be a bad idea because the whole point of us turning into AI in the first place would be to, like, keep our species alive? Well, what I was thinking is that it's just kind of the next... Like we've as long as we've had our chance, like we're not gonna. Ooh, uh, what? Amber relic. Cool. Got a thingy. So you're saying that we just we need to die off. Like we would still have our legacy. Like, uh, so, like, because oh, what it started making me think. Ooh, what? It means there's something special in that spot. Oh, cool. Oh, you didn't get it. Get it. Get it. Oh, oh, I get it now. Yeah, the little glowy spots. Um, so like we kind of leave our legacy with the robots, but then like thousands of years from now. Like, humans are sort of just legends. And it kind of made me think, like, what if, like, some weird supernatural uh, being, like, what if there really are, like, gods and shit, and, like, they created us to be the next, like, they're actually less advanced than organic matter, you know? Oh, okay. um, I see what you're Just mean. being, like, kind of an ethereal thing and just kind of seeded. This is where you were before, by the way. You just open up a shortcut. Oh, I see. Yeah, so you can go back up the log that you put down. Yeah. Oh, sweet. Uh, so then, the same sort of thing happens with like the robots. They're like uh, humans oh, are like gods. I don't know but, like, if you can reach it now that you've already gotten one of them down. But there's like a thing you can stick your sword into a fruit, and it'll like stick on the end of oh, your sword. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I don't. God, shut. Your this is mouth super. Uh, there are enemies in this virginity. Oh wait, what? Uh, she wants you to... Like, oh, I see. Yeah, you gotta find the Kikwi. Uh, it's literally oh, the same one I, that you were talking to earlier. He's just hiding, posing as a bush. I want to douse... Oh. So you either are looking or dousing Zelda right now. You haven't unlocked any others. So do I want to be dousing Zelda? Yeah. Okay. Because... He's right fucking there. Yeah, he's behind the tree. He's posing as a bush. You little shit. <laughs> Kill you. Oh. No. What? What? Keep going. Oh. Wait. It's right there. Oh, I see him. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't find him. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. What? Hit the toadstool. Like a bunch. Ah, uh, oh. I thought he was flipping me off for a second. <laughs> you motherfucker, that was my toadstool! <laughs> Okay, now more dowsing? Yeah. This is the tutorial for dowsing. This is horse shit. <laughs> I am starting to understand why Aaron did not like this game. <laughs> like, it's not bad, but considering what Zelda has been able to accomplish... Yeah, it's like a step backward. It is very much a step backwards. Like, it, it's forcing these tutorials on you instead of just letting you figure it out. Yeah. Which is what Zelda's always been famous for. All right, talk now to me, baby. Talk. You little mushroom kiwi thingy. Kikwi. They're basically like precursors to the kokiri. Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking. You don't want to eat me? Kwee! 
Like, it's so weird. The Hylians in every age in Zelda don't seem to change. They're basically just humans with long ears. Uh-huh. But every Magic. other race goes through, like, three different stages of evolution. Like, Zelda... <laughs> like, the Kikui go to the Kokairi, turn uh-huh. into the Koroks in Wind Waker or something like that. It's like... Like, how many... It's only, like, a hundred, couple hundred years in between each. Yeah. It's not, like, centuries or millions of years where actual... Like, there's gotta be some type of magic going on with the amount of evolution that's uh-huh. changing them. Because normal evolution wouldn't work. Furthermore, my analysis is... Just, yeah, this is fucking obnoxious. Uh, this stops at some point, right? <laughs> Of like, her talking to you like this? Just yeah. crazy I mean, it's dialogue. It's always kind of happening, but it it slows down. You really spooked me, Quee. Quee polyp. If you're heading that way anyway, Quee. What? Is that just like a verbal tick that he has? Uh, yeah. yeah. Clearly. You're <laughs> obnoxious. Alright, so. Yeah, so like stick your sword in it. <laughs> you can back up. Yeah. Yeah, stick it up, and then... What? <laughs> can I not just, like... <laughs> uh, maybe it doesn't do it with that fruit. There are other ones that you can do it with, though. Fuck the fruit. That goes uh, back to the beginning. You're right. Yes, yeah, so you'll go... Now I gotta go up. Yeah, you can go straight forward. Up. Oh, through here. And you're tired. <laughs> Good. What a wonderful mechanic. I, I, I think I'm just gonna... <laughs> I could see them Normal using the stamina point. meter when... Oh, okay. You can just roll a rock on him. <laughs> oh, fuck. You could pick it up. Oh, or I could just slide back down. I could see them, like, using the stamina meter when he's, like, going up these or if he's, like, climbing. But in normal situations where you're running, I don't see it, like, being a useful feature. Yeah. Uh-oh. Can I just, like, put it down on the... You just throw it. <laughs> <laughs> it was are, almost anti Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah. If it just, like, stops right in front of him. Oh, hello. You're dead. Finally, some more fighting. Because that's what we wanted. We were waiting for the fight. Yeah. Well, I've been waiting for puzzles, and those haven't happened yet. Yeah. What episode are we on? Like, four? Four, four or five. five? Yeah. <sighs> Need some puzzles. Need some puzzles. Okay. Duck Is scrub. he a puzzle? He's a duck of scrub. Is he a puzzle? No. <laughs> I'm gonna annoy him. You should equip your shield. Oh, wow. oh yeah, that's right. Uh, Before you get hit. No. No. Nope. It's the one that brought up your adventure pouch. I think it's B. What's that? What is that? Yeah, it's minus. God damn! Stop. Yeah. So bring up your shield. Give me a chance to. Fi- and then you use the left nunchuck to bring it up. Oh. oh. Nice timing. <laughs> that was pretty good. Yeah, that was the luck. Uh, bitch. Just, just, just. Bitch. She's like, like I just need it. Do you want to get me? <laughs> yeah, there's something to be said for really good like motion controls. This is about halfway there. It's cool. It's getting there. Like, but the thing with motion controls, like for me, is it has to be perfect for me to like it. Um, like, I can handle this. It's just not, like... It definitely doesn't <laughs> add anything to the game. Have you seen the Star Wars Connect? <laughs> oh, God. Have you seen the Rancor one? The Rancor, like, game type? Bah! You know what I'm talking about? Uh, I think it's so. It's called Rancor Rampage or something like that. Yeah. Where you're on Tatooine and you're a Rancor and you can, like... You see how, like, you used it so it didn't take any durability from the yeah. shield. Um, so in the... One of the mini games is called Rancor Rampage, where you're a Rancor, and the point is to destroy as many buildings as possible. Uh, oh, fuck oh, you're, hell. Supposed to, you're supposed to cut the. Yep, rope. learn that after I cut, jumped. Right. Um, but the best part about it is the fact that you can literally like you don't even have to do anything special. I was watching. Do you watch Angry Joe? <laughs> no, I don't. Um, so he did a review of Star Wars Connect, and he just literally put his hands in the air during the game and just went, like, back and forth, like, Ugh! and the Rancor is just, like, goofy hands in the air, like, Ooh! and then you just swing your arms. <laughs> it's literally just, like, mapping your motions exactly, but making them extremely goofy. I've definitely seen, uh, John Tron's 
thing of it. All right, so I'm done here. And then like the the dance off, basically. Oh, son of a bitch! He just did it again. I didn't even mean to do that. Like he just kept running. All right, gotta wait. Gotta wait. You can do it. <laughs> my my commentary is getting sparse now that there's like actually puzzleish sort of things. All right, so you're actually getting. Because now, I'm except like, you can't even yeah. do the puzzles. <laughs> okay, look, you did it. Yay! Next time on replay, swing. we're gonna talk to that big marshmallow. I'm gonna stay right here. <laughs>